I, I, I wrote a list. This one is sweet spice. My aunt sent me coolly, coolly. Do you know last time I ate this? This is Ogilibo. <laughs> she even packaged this, you can see. My, this is from my grandma. My grandma makes Ogiri, guys. She does it herself, like from the buying of the seeds to fermenting everything. She does it herself. She's the best. This Ogiri, you see the way it's sealed, yet I can still perceive it. Like, my house, the whole, my whole house is smelling Ogiri right now. Abacha! This is Abacha, shredded cassava. They call it shredded cassava, but this is Abacha. I did it, Mama. No, 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 don't touch it, don't touch it, okay? I come to the side. Oh, how's my favorite soup, guys? FYI, if you don't know. So if it's not fresh, it's not giving for me. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Joy, and over here we'll talk everything wholesome, everything beautiful, motherhood, lifestyle, business, faith, you name it. Anyway, today we're going to be unboxing these three items as you can see my goodies came in yesterday all the way from nigeria guys and i am so excited i'm so thrilled if you watched the video about my brother's relocation to australia you remember i talked about how i was worried and skeptical of um, sending foodstuffs with him to come to australia because i was worried that immigration would you know seize most of the items because obviously i'm not sending the usual i'm not sending all those that you see you know i'm sending things that are more you know more native <laughs> and i was worried that their botanical names would not make sense to the australian government you know so um i had to organize with my aunt by the way my aunt ceo be joy dishes sent me all these items guys look at my babies look at just take a look at my babies these three boxes you see here are filled with full stuff <laughs> They are filled with food stuff. Anything you can think of. Opa. Ogiri. Okay. Anything you can think of. Anyway, check her out. I'm going to put her business link here. She sells different kinds of food all over Nigeria. They are based in Festac, um, Lagos, but they, they do deliveries. They do like and food for weddings burials all sorts of occasion birthdays whatever you can think of and they are like beyond amazing this is just to tell you how amazing they are anyways thank you so much auntie i really really appreciate this without talking too much i'm going to be unboxing these items with you guys so come along <laughs> so guys i have to take a seat because these items are huge by the way special shout out to j n k foods she helped me package all my food stuffs if you're in nigeria if you're in lagos if you're anywhere in nigeria and you need to send food to diaspora j n k foods are amazing you can see how the packaging looks like this is ukwa this is ukwa because she would even name them put their botanical names package them in a way that foundation will not say no because it is well sealed okay anyways this is ukwa my aunt sent so many things. Uh, guys, I can't even begin to count. I'll just keep them on the floor. She sent so many things. I, I, I wrote a list. This one is sweet spice. Your girl is about to go crazy. <laughs> this one is dehydrated. She calls it dehydrated aura. <laughs> so this is oha. I don't like that. I don't like oha that is not fresh, okay? She added it. I didn't even know she was going to add it. I don't like oha that is not fresh. If it's not, because oha is my favorite soup, guys. FYI, if you don't know. So if it's not fresh, it's not giving for me, okay? I can make onubu that is not fresh, but if you oha, it has to be fresh. So I'll definitely make this for my husband and my family, my brother. Anybody can eat it. This is Ogilibo. <laughs> she even packaged this, you can see. My, this is from my grandma. My grandma makes Ogiri, guys. She does it herself, like from the buying of the seeds to fermenting everything. She does it herself. She's the best. This Ogiri, you see the way it's sealed, yet I can still perceive it. Like, my house, the whole, my whole house is smelling Ogiri right now. Abacha! <laughs> this is Abacha. Shredded cassava. They call it shredded cassava, but this is Abacha. I have a couple here because my aunt brought in a lot. Then this is blended crayfish. She sent crayfish as well. Blended and like 
they do it in such a way like the crayfish the fish and the okoroko the dry fish the stockfish i did it mama no 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 don't touch it don't touch it okay i come to the side sorry guys my daughter my daughter came and saw the food stuff and she was, she was also excited anyways let's continue so this is also a half i told you that she brought a couple of things this is a half as well ah this is also another for fish food stuff opa. then this is opa <laughs> guys this opa is plenty because i know she put like three painters of this opa this is just i think this is even like the left the ones that is it's plenty in this box let's keep unboxing this one is a huru a huru look at the name a huru ah you know now if you did cook all those native native you know what a huru does let me not talk too much opaka opaka nimo this is opaka guys see how dry jnk does it like she would steam it for two days so it's not even going to spoil once you take it off put it in the water and soak it for like 12 hours or 24 hours once you take it and take it for 12 hours or 24 hours you're good to go if you want to make a bacha anything probably you're good to go and this one is cameroon pepper my cameroon pepper i love pepper so much but all these things see see i see the packaging see how See how giving it is. I have to go buy come come on. My come come on, put all this things. So I'm done unboxing first box. I'm going to take it off now and start box number two. <laughs> Guys, starting on this box is my ego see See my blended ego see I need to shout out to JNK again. Like you guys, her packaging is next to none. I don't even know how she does it, but these items have been on transit for almost a month. From the time my aunt delivered it to a JNK, and from JNK packaging and taking it to um for to the people to the people for shipment till now, it's a month. But look at how fresh. Look at how fresh. Just look at how fresh. Anyways, this is my Gucci. We have a see here we have melon the way they do it the way um australia does it their packaging is quite different so when you blend it looks like light green but it takes exactly the same if not even better than what we have in nigeria but i told my auntie to just get me as much as she can because you know it's a once in a long time kind of delivery she hasn't done this in a very long time and i know it's because my brother came that's why she sent me all this but I told her to just get me as much as her, she can lay her hands on and so this I have a goosey Nigerian goosey <laughs> guys I told you that up a choke for this place see up a one up a two <laughs> oh my god sorry it spilled on my side guys up a three I'll be four what are we what number now up a three mm. Oh my god, the floor is everywhere. Oh, and then a goosey too. Guys, yeah, you see these food stores that my own sparked there. Anyway, you see, Bijo, please tell her that I said that. Don't tell her that her daughter is grateful for this show of love. <laughs> Guys, see my dry fish. See my dry fish. Ah, JNK. Take your flowers. Take your flowers. I believe in giving people their flowers while they are still alive and while they can smell them. This babe. And just you won't even believe how much she did all this for. I'm so grateful. Anyways, we're done. I'm sorry, my my the dust is anyway. This is the second box, second box, and I'll do the last one right now. Um for this one, this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like. Mm. Hey, we like, hey, hey. Can you see the box? <laughs> Another suya spice. Be joy falls me silly. She falls me silly every time. This is another suya spice, guys. <laughs> this one is stockfish. The other one is dry fish. No, my mom, I'm coming. I'm coming, okay? 
This one, that one was stock fish. This one is dry fish. We also have this here, guys. We also have this here, but when you want, um, how do they say it? When someone offers to give you a lot, take take as much as you can. Okay. She said she was going to give me different kinds of fishes, and I was like, you know what? Do whatever makes you happy. And she sent this, guys. She also sent Maggie. Maggie, no. We have it here as well, but she sent it. She sent two, three, four. Is it four? Yes. She sent four packets of <laughs> of um Magino. And then Uziza. Hey! Blended Uziza. Guys, blended Uziza. If you are a native girl like me, if you're an if you're an Anambra babe like me, I don't need to tell what they do with Uziza. <laughs> ah, this is also Uziza. Is this one Uziza? Yes, this is Uziza. This is also Uziza. Well, this is like the leaf, and that's like the blended one. She also sent palm kernel oil. This is for my daughter, Udako. This is Udako. So a little backstory. When I had my baby, um, the first, because if you're Igbo, you know the importance of Udako, like palm kernel oil. The first few months, my baby was having, you know, the normal changes and all that. And palm kernel oil is very important for moms, new moms, and moms, like for babies in general. So I didn't get it. I couldn't get it at the time because my, my grandma also makes this. She makes... She, that woman is more talented. I can't even really tell you things she does by herself. So um, she couldn't send it. And I told her, send it. Let me have it in my house. Like, I don't want to lack things. I, I don't like to lack things. Like things as important as this. So here it is. She sent it to me. I think there are two. I'm not sure now. But yeah. This is also another no cube. She actually sent five, guys. Five no cubes. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. And this is okay. <laughs> Locust beans. Okay. This one is the one that they would put on fire. It to be it will be like the the, the um the the aroma. I call I choose to call it aroma because it smells amazing. The aroma will be like all over the house. Even from here I can perceive it. Someone from the door can perceive this thing because it's, it's... Mama, I'm coming. Someone from the door can perceive it because it's actually nice. So guys, this one is blended ehu. I don't know what they call it in English, but it is ehu. If you're Igbo, you know what I'm talking about. This is what it looks like. Yeah. This is another okwa. <laughs> this is another okwa. You see how big the package is? Guys, my aunt truly packs all the... Just name it. Everything you can think of. I have it also another fish dry fish this is another fish and now i heard that fish in nigeria is so expensive i wonder how she's able to pack all these guys i'm so thankful i'm so blessed to have her in my life this is another stock fish i think this is the remainder of the one that was initially packed this one and then i have a bacha here Abacha here. So this is like the third, this is like four or the third one now. The third abacha. Guys, speed over. This is coolie coolie. My aunt sent me coolie coolie. Do you know last time I ate this? This is, this is just giving me very nostalgic feeling. I remember when I was growing up, then we go to Malam. <laughs> it's called <a> Malam. <laughs> I like quilly quilly and then we'll soak it with gari with hot I'm mm. um, sorry gari and then cold water just put quilly quilly this is me just want to sleep because <laughs> the that day you be useless for the rest of the day guys this is it i'm so excited i think she got just she got just she got just one box and i'm so grateful this is another ogili ibu huh. This ogili will last me for years, and I'm not even kidding. It will last me for years because 
Ejihike, let me say it in Igbo. Ejihike like, you know, just a little of it, your soup is made, if you know what I mean. So this will last me a very long time, guys. Look at these things are priceless. Look at just imagine as I open the box, the, the smell is like over the roof. No matter the kind of air freshener I use in this house now, to tell you how my grandma's will give me the scent. This one I, <laughs> they call it pocket repo. But yeah. And then another Utazi. Another Utazi. And then last but not the least, she sent me potash. So this is account account guys she sent me account i have like a stack of it am i not blessed seriously am i not blessed and that is a wrap guys <laughs> see my food stuff show them see everything just nego do my blessing just look at everything guys look at this i feel so blessed i feel so blessed guys thank you for unboxing my nigerian <laughs> food stuff with me if you're nigerian like me or if you've heard of this just i mean leave a comment down below tell me what your diaspora experience is if you've lived abroad and you struggle to get this kind of food stuff if you struggle to cook with you know local delicate local food stuffs like you know the ogiri the otazi the okazi and all that let me know how you navigate it in your country here in australia it's not that difficult because like i said in my other videos some people plant onubu if you notice there's no onubu here because i told my auntie specifically that i don't want onubu we have a stack of it people even have it in the plantations in their backyard but let me know in the comment section how you survive if you give it the diaspora how you get this native food because someone like me cannot do without it if not for anything i married a very very native man so i cannot do without it but let me know in the comment section what your thoughts are let me know if you enjoyed this video and if you want more native unboxing videos don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe share with your loved ones give this video a thumbs up if you love it and until next time bye guys <laughs>